Look at this cute little tank. This thing needs some serious upgrades. But before we upgrade, we need to see what we're up against. This seems simple enough. Drive your tank, aim your gun, shoot the enemies. Oh god, we got armored cars. Charge! What? He bounced it? That's amazing. He bounced another shot. I love the fact that we have actual ballistics in this game. Now we've got a basic World War One era tank, and if you look at this, we can seriously, seriously, seriously get some pretty amazing looking tanks. So what if I upgrade and then bought the next one? A T-60, a Russian tank, another Russian tank, another Russian tank. But the T-34 is notorious for being one of the best tanks of World War II. Let's upgrade our health. Or is that our gun? What's this? Honestly, I don't know what any of these do. But now we're bringing the glorious T-34 medium tank into battle to fight <laughs> armored cars. Look at this. I'm doing so much more damage. Two shots and they're dead. But the enemy numbers are just increasing. Fire! I just blew something up with one shot. It was off screen. I don't know what it was. We won't fire till we see the whites in their tank eyes. Can I run it over? Look at it, he's doing one damage. How cute. Come here, do you wanna die? <laughs> All right, fine, we'll blow you up. Oh, he hid behind his friend. Ramming speed. They're too fast. I mean, they are armored cars. Now, before we get to the rest of today's action, let me tell you about War and Order. War and Order is a game that you guys won't be able to put down. You can build a fantasy empire and battle players worldwide for reward. In game, you can command a huge fantasy army to fight in massive battle, defend against enemy invasions, build a kingdom, call on allies to help you, and become the most powerful king of all time. I mean, it makes sense because you are, after all, a descendant of the gods sent to protect civilizations from evil such as titans, leviathans, undead kings, and tons of other monsters that roam the world. Recruit soldiers, command archers, knights, cavalry, and mages to fight for your kingdom and even have the ability to train a powerful beast. One of my favorite things, well, you guys know me, is that you can create your castle and upgrade tons of buildings, resources, and powerful buffs. Research new tech, to craft weapons to aid in your battles, and you can even form alliances, fight, chat, and battle players in real-time PvP. This game is full of action and has something for everyone, though. So will you be the best? Will you go down in history as the greatest king ever? Find out now by downloading the game through the link on the screen or in the description to enjoy $60 worth of amazing gifts. Go build, fight, and conquer. And a big thanks to War and Order for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get back to the action. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's- that's a weird-looking tank. Oh, I've got boxes of explosives, which apparently do damage to me. Okay. I still want to see if I can't ram someone. But this seems like a game that's all about progression and upgrading your tank, and honestly, it's a lot of fun. I like finding little gems like this on the, uh, Google Play Store. Oh god, now they got infantry. Can I- yep, <laughs> I sure can. Oh, whoa, 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 this guy's got a Molotov cocktail. And he- he just disintegrated. I can blow them up with bazookas. Well, I mean, not bazookas, but 76 millimeter main battle guns. I'm gonna try to blow up that box. Ha! <laughs> and it blew up the tank and the infantry. I love that. Uh-oh. What if I just run that guy over? Do I take damage? Did you guys see me take damage? Everything was happening so quickly, I, I didn't know. Now, we just finished wave nine, we're about to go into a boss mode. And they call this a mine? Where we converted our old World War I era tank into a driller. And that is getting me quite a decent amount of gold. And uh, I can upgrade my speed and my armor. Let's upgrade armor a little bit. And let's see if our T-34 tank can deal with a boss. Cause I think we're gonna be fighting a boss. I'm gonna scare him into the boxes and wait for everybody to arrive. <laughs> oh, I love that. Now we fought mostly World War One era tech. So this is level 10. Okay, that would explain why there was no boss. There's gotta be a boss. There almost always is on wave tens. Okay, that bazooka guy's no joke. He does a decent amount of damage. The armored cars only do like one though. Boom! 
two for one discount oh okay we've got a new oh god oh god oh god oh god run that thing fires like guided missiles can i shoot them oh no will he run from me oh i can do 97 damage to him with one shot though he just dodged my shot we must have been at the end of the battle. Oh, I'm I'm inside of him and I don't think he can hit me now. <laughs> I have broken the game. Fire! Wow, so maybe on bosses we gotta remember to maneuver. Now, we've just finished wave 10 and fought our first boss and I'm thinking it's time for an upgrade. Now, when you look at this, this is a KV-2, a Clement Voroshilov 2, like assault gun because that tank cannon is 152 millimeters. You look at this, 76. It's clearly not to scale. And then we've got these beasts, including the IS-2, the Joseph Stalin II. Let's get this and let's upgrade our health. I think we're ready. Now, how much damage does this thing do a pop? That's gonna be the question. Oh, not too much more, honestly. It might just be cosmetic. He still molotov me! Well, that's unfortunate. I wish we would have had, like, a proper KV-2 explosive. I'm just gonna start running in- Oh, God. Dude, this thing is- Wait, that thing's destroying me. Whoa, 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 do you see that weird, like, skull? The exploding barrel? Alright, dude, get out of here. You're dead. He fires machine guns. Dang! Alright, he's gonna fire the little- Can I hit it? I'm gonna try to hit it. Fire! Yes! Okay. So that thing's gonna do a ton of damage if it hits me. Oh, he's getting ready to fire again. Oh my god, look at my health. We need a repair. Oh, and we, we call in a Spitfire. I can also call in an artillery barrage. Or maybe it's an airstrike. Airstrike! Yeah, it's definitely an airstrike. Oh, and he- oh, oh, he carpet bombs. That's awesome. We have a lot of those. I still don't have the speed to catch these little things. So the enemy is getting smarter in their tactics are changing. All right, call it an airstrike now. There's so many tanks out there. And I got that thing before he was able to fire the barrel of death. Yeah, I'm not worried about the infantry. I do I get 30 damage when they molotov me. Those guys were on the explosive barrels. Don't hit me with the bazooka. Okay, it's only 16 damage with the bazooka. All right, airstrike. Because those things are no joke. Their auto cannons do more damage than their, like, big cannon. Which I believe that's a Sturm Tiger, which is supposed to have a 380 millimeter main gun. That is big. <laughs> I just bounced. A KV-2 should never bounce. Firing HE rounds. Oh, I'm running into them, finally. Look at this. Look at how many tanks there are. Oh, we got a new tank. This looks like the World of Tanks light tractor. The little tier one German tank. All right, he's very strong. We're on level 17 now. We've been making some pretty good progress. What happens when I go past them? Can they kill me anymore? I don't think he can. <laughs> he has a lot of health, but he does not do a lot of damage. I gotta say, my favorite thing in this game is when the enemy posts up near the explosive barrels and just lets me blow them up and kill multiple enemies at the same time. Level 19. One more level before we fight the second boss. Alright. Boom! Did 49 damage. <laughs> just running over infantry. I wish the infantry had a little bit of physics to them. A little bit of ragdoll. So when you hit them, they'd go flying and go, Ooh! Ah, you get the Wilhelm screams in here. Wave 19 completed. Wait a minute. Can I? Let's upgrade before we fight this boss. Maybe this is my gun. Let's see if we just mass this thing up. How powerful can it be? Oh my god, that's all my money. I hope that was the gun. We'll know once we shoot something and see the numbers. Oh wow, yeah, I'm, I think I'm 51. That's better than the 28 I was doing, 48. Oh, that guy soaked up the damage. Alright, well, we've effectively- Oh, what is this? It's a gun. Oh, shoot. I can't go past it. He doesn't do a lot of damage. 
It's the Maginot line, maybe. Okay, one of these guys. He's already on fire? Oh, that's his logo. His logo is a burning skull. 127 damage to him. And I can just duck right under his shots. So I think I actually want to go to the T-34 again. Oh, no. All of my upgrades are stuck on that tank individually. Well, KV-2 it is. Fire! Should have done double damage to both of them. Uh, is that an enemy plane? He just dropped a little tank. What the heck? Is he gonna be flying back? Oh god, he is. All right, we've got a boss that's a plane. Oh, I missed him. Uh-oh. Reverse! Fire! Oh. Uh, all right, let's duck under him. Oh! That was scary. Now, is he gonna be coming from my left? Yes, he is. And fire! He drops the mini tank, which does some good damage. 21 a shot, and it auto-fires. Now aim the gun straight up because you know. Fire! Yes! We destroyed the enemy plane. Okay, the enemy units are getting a lot cooler. Kill the box. Yes! Two for one discount, and finish that one off. Glorious victory. Da -da 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 -da. I mean, it is a, it's a Soviet tank, all right? I ain't no communist, but I do like this tank. Oh, got the guy right before he fired the Molotov. Oh, and uh, World War One defensive installations. This is such a weird game, I, and that's what makes it a lot of fun. Pew. Dink. Like I'm a World War Two tank fighting World War One stuff mixed with World War Two stuff from a number of nations. I like I don't know who it is that I'm fighting. I don't know why that tank was on the box. <laughs> Wave 25. I haven't had to use my airstrikes. I have upgraded my tanks pretty dang well so far. It's time for an airstrike. Oh yeah. And the explosive crates. Yes, I got hit by the missile. Oh, we didn't even airstrike the crates, but I was able to take out the missile truck. Well, that was easy. Uh Oh, I hate these things. What happens if it does hit me? 58, that's a lot. Bum rush them. They're like, these are French tanks. You can tell by how fastly they go in reverse. <laughs> all right, what if I back them all up against this thing? There's one more tank that I need to back up here. Okay, and fire. Oh, well, we got some of them. You know what? You're right, guys. Like. Why do it yourself when you can call in the Air Force? Because they need to be upgraded, apparently. So we're on wave 29. We're curious what the boss tank is going to be. And after this level, we need to do probably a few upgrades before we face whatever it is. Beautiful. Airstrike time. Most definitely for this many targets. I was about to say, I'm surprised that one infantry guy is still alive. He just got carpet bombed. Okay, victory 400. We have 10,000 gold. We could save up for that and then probably get the IS-2 in the next video. If you guys do want to see more, if you're enjoying this, pull the trigger on the like button. I want to save my money, so we're actually just going to go into wave 30 and see what we got. Okay, there's so many enemies. Mostly infantry, but there's also the light tanks. Airstrike time. Look at this, I bounced right here. <laughs> I don't know if it's random or if it's actually, uh-oh. We've got a World War I tank. And I need to heal myself. Jeez, okay, we've taken a beating. Yeah, call in more reinforcements. We need more, okay, there we go. Oh my goodness, okay. And he's sending out infantry. So this is, this is the first real boss. This thing is amazing. Oh, oh God, okay. I rammed it and it was not good. All right, we've restored our tank. I think I need to stay out of range and don't get wrecked by bazookas. All right, I'm calling in another repair. Oh my God. One of those guns is devastating. Oh my God. Okay, okay. Just keep your composure. There we go, we got the bazooka. We called in another repair. It was necessary. Reload, ooh, and fire. 
and duck and fire. Oh, he's got one hit left. Charge, Buddha! Yes! We have defeated him with our fully upgraded KV-2. So, there's still a lot more. Like, look at this. We're at wave 31, and how many are there? Oh my. There, it looks like there are 60 levels and we're a little over half. So if you guys want me to show off what other bosses and enemies we might be encountering in Tank War 2D, well, Tank Battle War 2D game, we'll pull the trigger on the like button, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.